Hello everyone, from everyone at TPSG, we want to wish you a happy Black History Month. Yes, <clears throat> yes, yes. All right, Dude, we just gonna, made that. I'm not fucking yeah, that yeah. I was going, I was going. That's do your like, Black Pride, man. I was going to do like some, bah, 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 but I was just like that sound like some European shit. Yeah. So I had to, I had to, re, I had to remix it, like halfway through the thought. But yes, the real yeah. rhythm. Yeah. <laughs> before we put our, rhythm. before we put our knee into this topic, mm-hmm. let's introduce ourselves. Yes. Should we? Yeah, of I think course. We should. It's your boy Black Dynamite, aka Swiss Army Nigga. Uh, Swiss, Swiss Army Nigga. Right, one more time. Swiss, Swiss, Swiss Army Nigga. Just one more time. Swiss Army Nigga. All right. All right. And yeah, yeah. <laughs> Everybody's a Swiss Army Nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Versatility, yeah. All right. That's the same niggas that made the different world uh, theme song. Right. <laughs> Heard. And this is Flocka Zulu, Flocka Zulu, aka <laughs> Sir Black Stalin the Third, aka Pablo Escovich, aka No More, aka Stop the Violence, <laughs> <laughs> aka Stop the Violence, AKA Stop the Violence, AKA Dramatic, aka Loud Pack Chopra, aka Skip Bearless, Black Galifianakis, and I keep forgetting this other one. What is wrong with me? Wavy McGrady and Wave Chappelle. Wave Chappelle. Yeah. Yes, aka located in Wavy Jones' locker. Where? <laughs> oh, aka. Oh no, you got him. Aka okay, grown Bart Simpson. Aka. <laughs> <laughs> aka Bart Simpson is actually black. <laughs> yes. Oh, yeah, think about you, it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. But that's not why we're here. Oh yeah. shit. Yeah. That is actually why we're here. Yeah, Black History. Yeah, Black History. When you talk about, yeah. Uh, black before we, history. Before we continue, wow. I want to quote uh, <laughs> one of my favorite actors. And I feel like, I'm not sure if this quote is his, because I feel like somebody probably said it before, but I heard it from him. Mm. Morgan Freeman. <laughs> mm-hmm. He oh. said he believes there shouldn't be a Black History Month, because Black History is American history. Mm. So we should this, this should be regular knowledge. You shouldn't just only learn it f- um, in February. Mm. This yeah. be... I you mean, should I learn do, this just as much as I do. I do, I do enjoy the fact that you know that there is time taken out to address it specifically because mm-hmm. it's so. It, it's been something that's been un, held under like radar. You know, information that's literally mm-hmm. been withheld from the population mm-hmm. for so long that you know there's definitely a lot of catching up to do. Mm-hmm. And oh, there's a whole lot of catching. Yeah, up. yeah, but, and with, and with, the, and with this too. country, you know. Art history and their history cor- so deeply correlates more than most people realize, because you know it was black people that built this country. Yep. You know the reason why America is a financial powerhouse is because black people developed the country for free. Exactly. Mm-hmm. You know, so it's while like, while they got to sit down and relax and use their brains for their business plans mm-hmm. rather than yep. actually <clears throat> sharing crop and word so. word and a lot of that <sighs> and a lot of that um. A lot of that financial and and political power still remains in the same hands. You know what I'm saying? Like same con- families. Yeah, same, same families, families. You know, it just goes down the line. Where, and you know, you know, um, Wells Fargo. A lot, a lot of those big companies. Mm-hmm. Um, you know, a lot of those big insurance companies, mm-hmm. big financial mm-hmm. um, institutions, gained their fortune. You know, through the slave trade. Yeah. So it's like. You know, you can't... I bank at Wells Fargo. I'm so sorry, ancestors. Because the, the history is so insidious and the history is so, like, complicated that there's some things that yes. ha- that literally happen that sounds like legend. Yes. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's that's a great you know, way of putting it. Cold, motherfucker. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Dog, when that's, you bring it from that perspective, it's so crazy. Right. Right? Imagine doing something so crazy, the majority of people, people think don't it's a believe fucking it. lie. Word. Yeah. Like, like it's no way a human would do such a thing. Word. Well, actually. Well, actually. <laughs> hey, come talk to me when you could dunk on a... <laughs> <laughs> you could dunk, I'll nigga. Come it. talk to me, man. Flock of Zulu. No, no. You put that so beautifully. That was like poetry. Mm. How mm. twisted <laughs> can shit be, dog? No, it's crazy. Like, it, well, let <clears throat> let's, sorry, I, let's I be more specific about our sentiments right now. Mm. Mm. All right, basically, the sentiment we're coming from, right? If correct me if I'm wrong, is that while we do have Black History Month, uh-huh. mm-hmm. and we are giving, we are allotted this shortest month of the year 
time to reflect on our history and uh, people with melanin pigment pigments mm-hmm. contributions to modern society. You're right? absolutely that's right. generally what they put what the pretense is under, right? For Black right. History Month. Yeah, right. but pretty much. pretty much. Also, the reason why we sound so upset is because we keep getting the same cookie cutter story yeah. in Black History Month, whether it's Martin Luther King, I have a dream. They don't even give you the whole speech. Yeah. Um, whether it's they you know, really I, don't teach you much about Malcolm. They they or, really they demonize Malcolm they, X they when Malcolm X and, they, and, they, and Martin Luther King were actually cool. Yeah, they yeah. don't they don't teach well, they, they only focus on Martin and they don't tell his whole story. Exactly. Because yeah. Martin wasn't no punk. Word. So it's like Yeah, he was a preacher, he was a pastor, but like, you know, they, they paint Malcolm X as the as the radicalist or the radical word. because yeah. you know he's Muslim or you know Ex- he went word. against that the was grain a part in certain of it. ways. Mm-hmm. That was a part but, of it. And obviously he was angry, but he was intelligent, he was calculated while being militant. And word. it's just exactly. the Martin Luther King is definitely like, in my opinion, you know, if, if the if I'm and don't take this as any form of disrespect, mm-hmm. I'm gonna I'm gonna take yourself out of body and think of yourself as a white man, mm-hmm. um, who thinks you know, all right, well we can't ignore this any longer. Mm-hmm. So we gotta we gotta we gotta teach them you know put something in the books. For mm-hmm. them. Yeah. I so mean, who who are we gonna put? Not this guy. Well, He's gonna make them individuals. Yeah, exactly. You know, we we got it. We got Martin Luther them. King is great too, but we can definitely find some material in here that will play to our narrative. Yeah. Well, so we're thing, gonna we're not gonna give you the whole I I have a dream speech word, when you're in class. The you thing, know what I'm saying? yeah, the thing the thing they focus on with, with with Martin is how like oh you know peaceful you know peaceful protest peace and it's like they they only focus on that, mm-hmm. but they don't they don't. They don't focus on the, because a protest is a disruption, yeah, of mm-hmm. uh, of the status quo. Okay. They don't focus on that. They just they just they just see you know the pictures with the signs and people just saying hey you know something wrong. But Martin was one of the, like he 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 realizes like okay, um, the way I hit these people or the way I fed these people is through their pockets. Mm-hmm. So you know that's where the whole you know marching started going. They started boycotting um, the bus companies. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, and 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 they they just walk together. So you know, you know, I I don't know like just how much revenue like those that 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 they lost that they lost just based off of it, that. It but was that, but well, that was it w- that was a major driving mm-hmm. force you, it, more than anything. I'm I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Mm. Go ahead. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> it was significant enough to want them dead. Yeah, clearly. Clearly, like, dude, like it should just end there. Yeah, you no, know what I'm saying. Like any the fact, like, it, 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 any any black person that organized other black people was incentive because uh-huh. they kill they kill so like what they did to uh, Hugh, what, Huey Partner where they um, oh oh you you're talking about um whoa I just had his name wow I just had his name sorry continue continue when, when I'm gonna think of his name when they um when, Fred Hampton Fred they, Hampton they, yeah they killed him at. 12. 21 years old. Yeah. Nigga, you you know what I was doing at 21? Bullshit. Not thinking about shit like that. Word. No. Bullshit. Imagine, bro, imagine having a government pressed at 21 years Word. old, bro. And Word. he was outspoken and his and he had results behind his words too. Who was Fred That's Hampton. what made him so scary. Mm. Fred Hampton was in the Black Panthers. He was an activist. Just, mm. Yeah, yeah. He, he was an activist in the Black Panthers. Um okay. like in and it's common knowledge too. It's not like, oh, Theory has it that the CIA killed him. No, it is known that the CIA killed him. Yeah, and Martin Luther like, King. And Martin Luther King. Yeah. And, and a lot of your... Fa- like, it's it's crazy to me that that's like no knowledge and people are okay with it. Yeah. Or, you know what I'm saying? Then people known- don't believe you when you tell them things. Like, this has happened before. Why can't it happen wait, again? So, wait, so wait. Are what? you saying it's been confirmed in the public opinion? Pub- no, not, not what, public opinion, but like it's been confirmed and it is public knowledge that the CIA killed... Dr. Martin Luther King. Yeah. Yes. Because they took them to court and won. Yeah. Oh, Nobody yeah, see, talks wow. about that. Yeah. I didn't know. He that. won in a civil court, right? That's yeah. incredible. Who yeah. won? Yeah. Mar- like the, his family. His family. Yeah. yeah. Wow. Big, All right. So the go- yeah, because like, and that's the thing. Let's not. Yeah, that was like saying. And apparently, yeah. and the killer admitted on his deathbed that he killed him, but I don't know how true that is. Anyway, continue. Yeah. But yeah. The, 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 the the thing with America, and I feel like that this is the reason why there's a lot of the problems that stay around. Is that um, one the people the, the people who need 
I feel like when we talk about pla- black history, mm-hmm. the people who really need to learn that history have no interest in it. Mm, I, I, yeah, I, true, I feel true. like, you know, Word. America feels like, oh, this is time for black people to read upon their history. Like, no, Americans as a whole need to know the his- history. Yeah, exactly. Because it's your history too. Yeah, exactly. We're and all here together. We're, and, and at it's this be- point. It's because you don't know this history why a white man yeah. could say, well, if you don't like here, why don't you leave? He says that because he doesn't know his history. Mm-hmm. You know exactly. If you knew your history, that yeah. would even slip well, out of your mouth. Yeah, if you knew the history, it's like, why would I leave somewhere my ancestors built? Yeah. Well, you know the, the why white... Would, or, you know what I'm saying? Like, why would you... Why would you even... Um, not even see why my situation is the way it is? That's because you don't know your history. It, true. That mm-hmm. could be it. Yeah. yeah. You know, and, and like... Um, but it could be that he does know his history and... The plan was to get free labor mm-hmm. uh, out of, you know, people who were genetically superior. Oh, <laughs> oh, I mean, the, the, the idea was to get free labor, right? Yeah. To be able to, you know, build a country. Yeah. I don't know if the idea at the beginning was we're going to build a country, but it was like, we're going to come here, we're going to start new, mm. and we have some of these people here mm. that we're going to get to do all the work for us. Yeah. And and it's and, and that's it's and that's all it is. Yeah. yeah. And it, so so yep. to them, <laughs> you can't even assume that they would even have a heart. Word, word. In their ancestry to 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 believe somebody, that we are human and accept us yeah. as a part of their history. No. Somebody they they have that. accepted that yeah. that Africans are a part of their history. They also mm-hmm. accepted that they didn't give a fuck. Mm. About Africans, I, well, I'm glad you fuck. brought that up, man. Because I feel like I feel like there are two. Well, ty- I feel like there are two types of racists. There's several. Well, well, there's several. But I, well, I, I'm, a, I'm a category. Well, what's your opinion? Man? I'm a very, well, be I'm careful a, not to mix racism with prejudice, too. A lot of people do that. Well, no, well, no well, it's, let's it's racism. Right, it's racism. Right, let's hear the point. Because it's there's two types of ra- racists. Mm-hmm. There's there's the there's the deliberate racist mm-hmm. who knows the history, but it's not only. Fine with history, but proud of the history. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So he, he, this is the type those that, are the get her done. Yeah. No, this is you know I'm talking like the white nationalists, the people. Oh, who, those. Yeah. Yeah, the people who hold Hitler in high esteem, who yeah. actually believe, um, the that guys that, that are in suits and clean cut. Yeah. Now. That <laughs> that people, you know, they actually feel like white people are superior. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And there are people who feel that way, um, subconsciously. Yeah. And those are the type yeah. of pe- those are the type of people who and I saw this the other day. It was like a it was a it was a a picture and it was talking about how um, in in some regions and they used Africa people had to travel miles to get water, and you know there I saw I, I, I was looking at the comments and of course it's it's white dudes like they're just weird. always always <laughs> talking about Why was this YouTube no this was like um Instagram. Oh, that's even worse. And then, and it was like, oh, why don't, why don't they just like move closer to the water? It's so stupid. Why don't they just move closer to the water? And I'm like, I'm like, you're so arrogant. You know the answer to everything, don't you? You know what I'm saying? You're so arrogant, and you all, you feel that sense of superiority to where you really think niggas haven't thought of that. <laughs> like, if that was the option, you really think people let's be walking start there. Miles, like, miles, like you let's really start feel there. look and, and, and like how long have you been on this earth in word. comparison and, to how long the earth and has it's been like here? and that's like, seriously that's the type of person who will tell you that he's not a racist, right? You know what I'm saying? They'll tell like, you why he's not a racist, word. Yeah. But then it's like you make that 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 tells me all I need to know about you because like one, you feel like you're smarter than these people, obviously. <laughs> yeah. To, yeah. To, to, to even say I'm innovative. To, I don't know. Shut word. the fuck up. To 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 even re- think that you, as somebody looking at a picture, would just come up with a with a solution to a problem that's existed for so long. It's like yeah. you really feel like, <laughs> and a lot of times they do, like they'll look at people's situation, and they'll have like an over oversimplified answer for it because they don't really relate. That's generally so, an elitist standpoint. Yeah. Well, I mean, and and to. I mean, not throw away the term, throw around the terminology mm-hmm. that everyone's using nowadays. But truth be told, that is very yeah, like you're saying, it's very arrogant. It's it's arrogant to just you know belittle a situation to the magnitude of how long it takes to say that state that short statement. Yeah. you know what I'm saying, like to say that like you know why didn't they move closer to the water? Like, do you know what that means for yeah. civilization? Yeah, do you really understand what it means to move closer to a water when you're on the largest 
fucking continent in, in the, the world. world. Word. You world. know what I'm saying? <laughs> so it's like, imagine it's like, not only are you in the largest continent in the world, but but a lot of that land is, is um, you know, it, 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 you can't, it's not farmable. It's, um, right. it's, 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 um, what's the word? Um, I know what you're trying to say. Yeah. You know, well, like, uh, uh, yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, like, that majority, that portion of it, you know, more inland and whatnot. Well, but what's even more beautiful about it, so let's not, to not go too far into the negative aspects mm-hmm. of things. Oh, oh, there's a place in Africa where the where the desert meets the ocean. Did y'all know about oh, that? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's mm-hmm. crazy. It's beautiful. Yeah. Yeah, yeah but yeah, oh, just, to, pictures. just to finish my point. Like there's the outright racist who like the white nationalists, and then there's the racist who's racist because of their ignorance, you know, because right. because they don't know the history of certain things, because they don't know why certain things are the way they are. Because mm-hmm. there are people who say things like, like um, you know, why are black people complaining when you know they just made the bed bed they made the beds that they laid in. Oh so, no! So they beca- our because our bed was made for us way before. But, we, but, but see, they don't know here. that. They don't know that, and they don't care to know that. Yeah, exactly. So they'll make those statements, and they'll in 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 their mind they'll be like, "Well, no, I'm just saying it because I'm being honest, and this is what they need to do." But it's like you're coming from a place. Uh, n- not only are you coming up from a place where you not re- you don't really care, because mm-hmm. you know <laughs> just to say something at, at to say something at people instead of saying something mm-hmm. to people, it shows you you don't, you don't care. You're not thinking about yeah. that. Yeah, and when and when you think that you know. The answer is so simple, cause like, oh, all you gotta do is you know get a job and da da da. It's like, bro, it's never if simple. it was if it was that easy, you really think like, and it's and and it shows like it shows in their comments or how they speak that they really feel feel well, like they're superior. But that because because as feel, you say, it comes because they ignorance. feel like they feel like black people are where they are and mm-hmm. white people are where they are because mm-hmm. white people are superior. But most people just say that because as you said it's ignorance, ignorance because of their experience. You know, a lot of these people who make these kinds of comments have a, a an elder in their family whether it be a mother, father, uncle, whoever or a friend mm-hmm. of their parent who can give them a job. Mm-hmm. Plain and simple. Yeah. And usually it's a decent paying job. Mm-hmm. You know, even on the on the lower <laughs> level, you mm-hmm. know. It's still even at the entry level, it can still be a decent job that you can get from because you know somebody who you're from, you know, possibly an affluent community. Yeah. And then, aside from that, they are they don't understand the idea that in these other communities, the type of jobs that are in these communities are for the most part there's not a lot, mm-hmm. and they're at the corner store, mm-hmm. at the, you know the quick stop that's probably owned by someone that don't live there. Yeah. Um, <laughs> or um, minute, or or much, anything you know, there's not much. a whole lot of black owned businesses out there. It depends mm. on certain communities you go to, mm. uh, or you know, I should say businesses owned by the community members. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah people yeah, who live mean. there, and so you know, they're they're coming from a complete place of ignorance. You know, they're just saying, mm. yeah, well, this is the solution. No, this is the solution from your objective of life, but mm. you haven't actually sat down and thought about what life is like for other communities where they haven't had the resources given to them that you were given. Yeah. You know? Absolutely. Like, they, they're incapable of thinking that way. So, like, yeah, sometimes there's people who are ignorant and choose to be ignorant, and then you have those others who are just ignorant and um and didn't and don't know. Yeah. So I guess the hard part is, <laughs> on our end, you know, what are we going to choose to be? Like, are we going to be mad every time we see these things? But well, honestly, if you are as informed as we are about it, then no, you won't get mad all the time. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? You'll understand certain things happen for a certain reason. Mm-hmm. You know, there is a, <clears throat> um, whether radical radicals want to believe or not, there is a time to, you know, be calm. You don't have to charge mm-hmm. every single time. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So, I know a- another thing I wanted to, to point out too is like when they talk about just to get back to black history is um like where they start with black history because oh, yeah. in america all they talk Yo, about say that again man is where they start um there's a you know with black there's a um there's a book that i read like this book is so dang complex like you gotta it's one of them books that you gotta read each sentence is like each sentence three times just to <laughs> <laughs> to to slightly get what she's talking about because the the verbiage is so complex, mm. but it's called um the phys- uh the physics of blackness. Ooh, I like the title already. Yeah, yeah. and what it what it talks about, mm. um, you know, and I'm I'm 
I'm going to give like the simplest like synopsis of the book, but what it talks about is like the power of like origin and just like the um the the like a, the the singular time scope where it's like you know there's a beginning the end and there's like a there's like a one viewpoint of history to where like where history is really told from a million viewpoints and it's not just like from beginning to end it's not um What's the word I'm talking? About? It's not just. It's not linear. Yeah, it's not. It's linear. not just linear. Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. There's many things happening simultaneously. Exactly. I gotta yeah. read this book. Exactly, bro. Yes, dog. <laughs> so it's not. It's not linear. So and they talk about the dangers of a linear timeline and a and a timeline with a beginning and an end because we're always. As it should be. Yeah, because <laughs> we always talk about like even with storytelling, there's always a beginning and an end, and with Black history, the beginning always um, starts with slavery in this country. And always, they, always, always, and they, when the history is where, and they way always further bark. And and the, and the, but not to, and not the, to put uh, any damper on slavery, it's still a extremely important subject. No, no, but, that's what, not what where I'm, we started. Yeah, exactly. But what they, what what they're saying is our power comes from our upliftment from slavery. From slavery, yes. right. Mm. But then our power was long before that. They long don't talk, before mm-hmm. they don't talk about you know ancient you know African civilizations. Mm-hmm. Who studied, you know, astronomy? Who, mm-hmm. you know, had huge libraries and cities and, mm-hmm. and palaces, palaces, and 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 you know, tra- traveled traveled the world. You know, mm-hmm. Moors traveled the world like long before, like Columbus and yep stuff like, like people like that. So it's like and the Moors were African. like I j- yeah, yes. <laughs> and I joke about it, but the Moors really did teach them about proper cooking and hygiene and. Just regular living shit. Word. And you know you, what I'm saying? Nothing. Word. It's just. And when you when you look at stuff like, um, even like the 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 pyramids in Egypt, how they aligned with the stars, with the stars. Mm. and the fact that, um, there are pyramids outside of Egypt in Africa. All you pyramid, know, there are yeah, pyramids, pyramids up everywhere. and down the Mississippi River, bro. Yeah, you, word. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> word. For real. For real. So it's like there there's there's all types of ancient knowledge that they that they don't share. And it's like there's a con- like a concentrated effort mm-hmm. from a long time, dog. Like mm-hmm. the fact that you know. It's funny you talk about that because oh mm-hmm. no keep, no go go because it's funny you talk about that because I was you know I, I'm actually looking to purchase this book. My next purchase is um first of all y'all check out a book called The Destruction of Black Civilization. Mm. All right, and it's from certain time periods of during those great ancient civilizations in Africa. But <clears throat> that's a sidetrack. That's also on my list of, you know, what I got to reread because I've mm. read some of it as a kid. Right. Um, but the next book is called, um, I don't remember the name of the book, but it's it's all about um, Native Amer- Africans being here already. Mm-hmm. Like Africans were here before, I think I've quote, Columbus. Uh-huh. You know, they were already here interacting with the natives, mm-hmm. you know, and are and already interbreeding and stuff like that, too. Um, if you want to use interbreeding, but yeah, like <laughs> a- Africans were already here. And oh, there's a book called um, um, They Were Here Before or mm-hmm. something like that. Yeah. And um, Even- and and I, you know, to think about it, it's like, oh, shit. Yeah. Yeah. yeah even, <laughs> of course. <laughs> of you, course they were here cuz the amount of slaves that they claim came over for the type of boats they had back then it doesn't add up. Mm-hmm. I mean, yeah, granted they, you know, a lot didn't make it here. Mm-hmm. But at the same time, if you think about it, the multitude of Africans that came to this soil like were were they really all taken here? Nah. Nah. Bro. Nah. Mm-hmm. Nah. Well, <laughs> but uh, you, you two um, bringing up books and everything kind of brings me to my next point, because a lot of the stuff I know about Black history I either learned from my father, from my parents actually, word. from my parents or a teacher. Mm-hmm. And twelfth grade, I don't even remember in all Miami schools when they implemented the uh, seventh and eighth grade, mm-hmm. like because if you had a bad grade, they added extra hours to your school day. Like, oh yeah, that's yeah. Gonna oh, oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> but anyway. Eighth period, I had a teacher. I'm not gonna call his name, but you know, shout out to him. It was a black history, black history um class. Mm. You know, all of everything was centered around black history. I learned so much shit from this dude. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like, I didn't learn that. You know what I'm saying? Like stuff about slavery, like you guys are naming mm. that. You know, not every part, every African. <clears throat> sorry, every black person that came over here wasn't a slave, and they weren't mm. brought over here, right? And everything, so on and so forth. So that brings to the point that. I encourage, like, you know, all my, I got a tons of homies that are teachers, mm-hmm. male and female. I encourage y'all to 
inform your students about it. Like you don't have to yeah. cut out an entire letter, but at least sprinkle it in there somewhere because Word. it's important. Because nobody else is doing yeah. it, you should be the one to do it. Word. It's important for these young children to know that their history does not start with being captured, mm-hmm. with being enslaved. Yeah, mm-hmm. their history does start before that. They need to understand that these same people, the the these you know generations later who were enslaved, these same people were the ones who instructed and taught the world mm-hmm. around them. And, yeah, mm-hmm. and, and other people, you know, civilizations from other countries, mm-hmm. you know, came to Africa to those colleges right. and to those schools to learn, and to learn mathematics, especially to learn if you science. know stuff that is a common knowledge, share it. Yeah, like enrich everyone. You know what I'm saying? Don't be stingy. Or <laughs> even even ancient Greeks, like you know, there are certain cultures that are that are um more you know celebrated. Than others, because mm-hmm. mm-hmm. we all know about Greek and Roman mythology, but mm-hmm. we don't know about African mythology. Mm-hmm. You know what mm-hmm. I'm saying? We don't. We don't even know Guilty. about. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? And, and if you want to look at history from a linear standpoint, well, a the, lot in, of it the inspiration, up. or if you want to say exact stories, mm-hmm. come from African history. Because if you look at it from a linear standpoint, these stories, uh, these um, theor- uh, these uh, this mythology was written before. Mm. These Greek civilizations. Yeah. So, like, and a lot of when you look at books, when you look at Greek writing, a lot of them talk about African civilization and hold them in high esteem. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you mm-hmm. know what I'm saying. They talk about the dark people from across the seas, and like they really talk yeah. about them like high. Even, even in their artwork, they draw a lot of the gods as being black. Mm. Wow. You Remember know, the um the Sphinx. Seen. The Sphinx was um made after a black person. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Of course. And they went as far. That's why the nose isn't there. Where yeah. they went as far as shoot off the nose. But, yeah. Um, but yeah, you know, like I said, I challenge every instructor, your professor, mm. from pre-K to, uh, you know, Ivy League colleges, like Word. inform your students somehow. Where and, you know and, and, just, and um, I'm not just it, not just black. Yeah, black I was just people. about to say that. Yeah. Not just black no, students. Just inform everyone. everyone. Yeah. Is, you know what I'm saying? Like I'm not gonna go into it because th- I'm sure y'all saw. Remember at the end of Chappelle's special mm. when he told a, told a story about Emmett Till. Yeah, right. That was perfect. He picked some guy never heard of it. it like you know, do something like that inform yeah. people yeah. so they can realize how heinous and how awesome a lot mm. of this shit is. Right. You yeah. know what I'm saying? But they always emphasize the terror, the horror. They always emphasize like black people have. Con- but black then, people have contributed more but then, to society than we sa- get credit for. At the same time, they always highlight the the bad shit, man. At the same time, they don't even tell all of the horror. Oh, God. oh they you know don't. They, they definitely they, they they don't. That's scarier than the horror itself. America, that there's more a, shit we do not know. America makes a just conscious, imagine <laughs> makes a conscious effort to eliminate a lot of that story. Yeah, yeah. Um, I, I, you I, know I, when you I, read the story, the history books and. Things like that. Where they yeah, tra- because there's a saying like, if they knew what we really did to them, they mm-hmm. like the, the saying kind of revolves around if you really knew what happened and what we did, mm-hmm. peaceful protest wouldn't be an option. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Because the only way to react to this is you know get y'all motherfuckers out of here. Right. Like there, there's a legit people that want all white people like gone, either dead or just gone. Oh yeah. Yeah. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Because they're. You know, it's it's a whole. That's theory, ex- that's it, that's yeah, extreme. That, that's extreme. extreme. No, it is extreme. Um, but is extreme. I mean, if if it ties into ancient civilizations theory of white people being the bad in the bunch, yeah. <laughs> no, that's no. Over. But white you people, know, it's funny. I don't roll with that. We're all human. Oh, <laughs> white people have tails. They're not from this planet. Yo, all right. So <laughs> yeah, not I mean, comfortable I mean, here. <laughs> that, that's 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 a big part of. You know, Still human me, history that we haven't <laughs> we haven't learned all the pieces to that puzzle yet because yeah. if you want to go back and talk about other civilizations like where humans are like one of how many different um human um homo well not necessarily homo sapien but mm-hmm. uh yeah. upright mammal species mm. you know that walk the earth if mm. you want to look at it from a scientific standpoint you know they say where that's from what these crackers breeding with these animals. Oh my god! <laughs> yeah, think about it like that. Yeah, 
But so you trying to say we started out as human, then they fucked the monkeys or whatever. And then that's and how then DNA got mixed that's in. How DNA got we, we that's get, why you look at a fish. And this looks like see, Bob. See, this is <laughs> when, this is when we transition to getting <laughs> that's the, real the, deep. The crazy like the, the, the black and black. I, I, black. I, I, you see, I, you I just think, said it wait, earlier. Yeah. It think, sounds crazy, but it might be the fucking truth. I think yeah. we're gonna need yeah. to yeah. wait till like episode five million. Wait, um, to really yo, if I make five million that, episodes because, of this. I and think I'm not a billionaire. Somebody's I, I, dying. I think we need to be a bit, uh, have a little. No, bit more I want when they find my lost dealt. tape. Hold up, nigga. No, you gonna find my lost <laughs> tapes. Need, they... You gonna help me trash these W's as we so aptly <laughs> named them. We need to wait till we learn Black at power. least twenty more years worth of knowledge. <laughs> Probably <laughs> before we talk about this topic, because you can learn twenty deep. years of knowledge in a week. My bro. brain hurts on Wikipedia. Man. <laughs> oh God, man! They well, did what? <laughs> well, oh, all right. God. Well, you know, to, oh, to big to, silly. To, Sorry, just big to, silly. To basically. tie it all together, to wrap it up and tie a, a, a nice little pretty bow on it, you know, it's spread knowledge. Spread knowledge, pretty yeah. much. Yeah, it's just spread knowledge. Spread knowledge, because it's like. We can't hide from our history. Nope. Cause that, that's the you main. That, that's the, the main past. thing. Cause I've, that's the main thing holding us back. I don't know if I mentioned it. I, I, I we talked about it before, but I, I forgot if we if I said it already on a podcast. Like giving the example of Germany, uh, how they you know they don't shy away from their history. Right. Their monuments everywhere. The swastika flag is illegal to fly in Germany. You know they teach. Yeah. They wow. teach. You know they don't. They teach the history in schools. They don't. They don't mince no words. They are like, yep. Can't. Ju- yep. That's called accountability. Accountability. Yeah. But that, that's the thing with America. There's no accountability with America. None. They sweep it. Everything under the we had to do, it had to happen. Where like when every mm-hmm. step of the when you think about it, every step of the way when it comes to like black people, it's been a fight. Yeah. And America has been the opponent. Yeah. Right. You know what I'm saying? So Real America shit. people of color. And we were word. brought to this fight without word. So like, <laughs> I again again Not all of us. Yeah. Some yeah. of us were here. Yeah, yeah. But you know, just the just the point of like America is still the opposition. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, to where it's like you know it's, Why don't you go to Africa? Yeah. So Bitch, like, I might. <laughs> they've 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 never tried to change. We need never. to roll aside. They've never they've never taken accountability. Nope. And that's the main thing and it's and it's gotten to the point now where people out because they're so separate from from the from it and because they're so you know they're kind of like arrogant they're like you know it's oh it's it's it doesn't exist anymore mm-hmm. and they literally ignore the millions of outcries saying otherwise because they don't you know they don't see it that's true it's no, unfortunate but it's true if i'm yeah. not mistaken and i'll need to re you know research this again uh, but I learned that recently, like some form like of government mm. in like in like an official statement did, you know, admit that, you know, slavery was heinous. Blah, 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 mm-hmm. But they did make a disclaimer and say this is in no way. Uh, um, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think they called it an admission. I'm using the wrong term. But <laughs> like this is in no way like um, a, a promise of reparations yeah, or yeah, reconciliation. Yeah. Like they were just making a statement saying. Finally, outright saying, "Yeah, slavery happened. We mm. did it, and it's fucked up." Two but things. One, they didn't. They were like, "We're not giving you anything." Two things. Mm. One, that sounds like an ex hitting you back, just admitting that she shit on you, but she still got shat <laughs> on. <laughs> and two, <laughs> oh damn it, bro, Bring it, get it, get you it. Back. To, no, no, I'm gonna. You need to stay. You need some ginkgo biloba, nigga. Word, you you need to stay off that grass, nigga. Your short term memory is a. Trophy. What you mean? I love standing outside. Ha. Ah. Anyway, <laughs> but yeah, um, damn it, I can't believe I forgot. I can't believe I, you said it's. You said that's in no way an admission, right? Mm. And then I was like, and then or you, reparations and then, or reconciliation. and then he was like, boom, oh, boom. All right, there you go. Do you think we deserve reparations? Of course. Okay, we do. Good. Um, but yes. but but <laughs> that was my question. We we do. <laughs> we do. Yeah, straight up. Plain and simple, we deserve reparations. Um, if y'all want to go ahead and do the test and blah blah blah, everyone who's been enslaved deserve reparations, dog. Yep, straight for up. their ancestors because it wasn't fair. It wasn't yeah. a fair fight. Like you didn't have a chance. Like with our wits and our knowledge, like we could have been a superpower. Yeah. yeah. Or we any, were the or super- not not. I'm not gonna say we, but anyone. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, Cuz yeah, there's yeah. so many cause If you want to talk about capitalism and how word. it's so great, when you you, look, you should have had a level playing field if that word, was the case. Word. When, when you started. when you look around like it globally, it changed the world. 
Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? To where Africa is still being exploited to this mm -hmm. day. Yeah. To where to where countries are are not allowed to use their resources. Yeah, exactly. So it's like the you're still resources. holding holding country, you know, and and countries like the U.S. are destabilizing all kind of places all over the world. So it's yeah. like it, it's not level, and they've and they've more than reaped the benefits. Right. So it's it's about it's about <laughs> it's about leveling the playing field, man, and just like getting that chance to for for us to because the people who. People, How about we make the, our own playing field? I was just gonna say but that, then, like, but then, like, but then that's what that's what we have to do. Because again, and we're doing that, and we're doing that, and again, again, it's always us against America, and we and we can never, and that's why that's another re reason, reason, not to get off topic a little bit. I feel like America is the next Rome, to where it's going to implode. Oh yeah, oh, yeah. people have been saying that for years. Yeah, so yeah. it's going to implode but, on itself, but, and it's its own fault. You but know? when in Rome, yeah. <laughs> Exactly. Kill these hoes? Oh. <laughs> um, no, but you but yeah, <laughs> no, hey. Like you said, to tie it all up. No, to tie it all up. I do want to say something before we leave, y'all. Mm -hmm. That like that that little video you posted from um that dude that was saying, you oh. know, please oh, yeah. remember that you know Black Panther is still not a black made movie. Sidebar. And I've been, I felt that way Panther. about that. Um, yeah, it's you know black and black excellence is a part of Black Panther, mm -hmm. but Black Panther is not made by a studio that was established by well, colored people. Well, I mean, and I'm not saying that where I'm not talking. He's not. I'm saying going to watch wrong, Black Panther. Though. What what dude is trying to say is remember, yeah. don't be fucking stupid, you idiots, and look at this commercial and say, oh, it's our turn. It's Black Excellence. No, you fucking. Dummies, it's okay, an industry that. that is controlled by people who are not of your community. So understand yeah, that it's that. not your movie, okay? Well, it's a movie that was made by a studio that is predominant that is owned by white well, people. Well, Granted, it's still a great black movie, yeah, but, but it's still not a movie made by black people but, but, altogether. Well, but here's the thing, here's the thing, here's the thing. How I feel about that. Mm -hmm. Is that um one? I feel like when he was saying, it, I feel like it was coming from a place where I feel like he's one of those people that like if if something's like so universally accepted or universally loved, he gotta like, say something. Yeah, like they gotta have something to say about it to kind of like you know be the you know hey not to spoil the party but you know. But he I, didn't sound terrible. He but then, sound, but it, well, no, to me, let me wait. Let me wait to to me, me, when he was talking, it was he made he one he made assumptions. He made the some he made the assumption that. You know that behind the scenes there are a bunch of white hands on it, and there may be you know editors and stuff like that, and producers, maybe executives who are white, who put their hands on it. And also, he made the assumption that those people who put their hands on it hate black people. That's what. That's when I was just like, well, uh, that's the thing. That's, that's when, not his but view. The, the problem, no, no, no. But then, like, that's his what, view is like, like he, no. That's yeah, what that's, he said. No, no that's no, what no, he no. said. He was but, like. He was like, he was like, there, there's these, there are white, these white people behind it mm -hmm. that don't, that hate black people. That, that I'm like, you can't assume that because. Well, what, he, he's what, praying what, what, this, He's saying everyone in Hollywood but, hates black people. It yeah. doesn't matter if it's an editor or a producer. Yeah, but here, but here's the thing. But here's the thing though, because we can't, we can't take away from wins or pro progress. When I see a, a, a movie like Black Panther, I, I see progress. Mm -hmm. And I see, yeah. a, and I see a great victory because. But that's not, not taken only, away from because, it. What no, he's saying, yeah, cause not only because mm -hmm. because when they say that, they kind of takes away from because it gives because he was saying that there because he even said that mm -hmm. there might be hidden what it, oh yeah he also said there might be hidden messages and because there might be nigga but then, but then, there will be then, yeah. there always is yeah. but then but then but then again again it's like assumptions into mm -hmm. it because when I because when I looked into the movie a lot of. A lot of um, the characters and the development of the mm -hmm. movie came came from Africa. came directly from yeah. African yeah, civilization. True. Oh, of true. course, and it's a great and the fact that it's a great representation, like the it's the, actually a good representation. Just the just just the fact of being represented represented in general, the fact that you know after that movie comes out, there are, there are literally a bunch of different costumes now a black kid can That's pick on good. Hollywood. Yo, and we're, that is, you know no, there that's, is positive. That's stuff, good, and we're grateful. But then, that's good, and we're again, grateful. What again, we're saying it, is, well, well, it's just another step in progress. Yeah, but yeah. to but, then, but to but stay then, awake. But then, yeah, but no, then no, we got of gotta, course stay awake. But then we got But we got to be. We got to be careful of not being because. I feel but like nothing's yeah, infallible. No, yeah, we got. We got to. We got to be. We got to be careful 
of how critical we are, or not even how 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 I don't even know how to express I mean, it. But we got to be careful how we how we say things, cause it's like I think we'll f- because it's like things we got to we got to record like. I agree. Got to see things for what it, what it is, mm-hmm. but then we also have to empower things too, because it's yeah, like yeah. But and, I'm and we got to and we got to see things like okay, this is this is a step in the in the right direction. Because mm-hmm. even even if they're like you know white executives who are like all right, cool, and just based off of greed mm-hmm. um, reasons, they they approve the move. The fact that because before let, they, they let did, me ask you something. Hold on, hold on. Be, be, because <laughs> I'm sorry. No, because before nah, figure wave was no, hilarious. no, but no, because before then they didn't do that because they felt mm-hmm. like black stuff wasn't marketable, that it wouldn't make enough money. Mm-hmm. So the fact that that's they, what they said. That's what they said. So even, even, even the if, white owned companies. Even, yeah. So even the same if, white owned company that's no, making no, look, Black listen, Panther. Listen, because even if they, <laughs> sorry, no, but no, because that, that, yeah. that that's a realization that they have to make. Yeah. But even but is it? No, even even if. They're going for oh, this black shit is on the rise. Let's make no. Movie. That's the truth. Listen, yeah, because money is king. and it's money making. Bro, listen, listen. Mm-hmm. Even if that's the case, I'm just trying to wait till you make the point. No, I'm trying to make the point. If y'all would shut the fuck up. <laughs> if, even Excuse if, me. Even even if that's the case, that is a win because that shows mm-hmm. that there's there's financial money power in our culture. Right. True. So right. it's like True. they can't deny that anymore. Right. Because that's why that's right. why there was no representation. But it wasn't denied before. They've been making money off of us. See you. You're exactly, exactly making my point. <laughs> You're making my point for me, Black Stallion. We're getting lost in the fact that we've been giving a chance or given an outlet. This is not this is not our media outlet. This is not ours. It wasn't made for us or by us. Nope. So the point what I'm trying to make is that while the man is not saying don't go watch the movie, mm. he wants you to be aware yeah. that you're watching a movie that was made by an entity that never cared for your culture. Mm. All right? The 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 basis of that entity, the foundation the basis, exactly. of that entity, which is whatever the studio is creating it, not Marvel, mm. but the actual people who are fronting all the money for this project, mm-hmm. they still have a hand in it. Mm-hmm. They send it down the corporate ladder mm-hmm. and that's they're going to give you your little look because you can't hide us for so long. You yeah. can't hide this culture that has influenced all culture for mm-hmm. so long. So yes, you do give it its outlet. You do admit that it's there mm-hmm. and there's always going to be people who are good in the top and there's going to be people who are bad. Mm-hmm. But what the point I was trying to make was that be aware that this movie was still not made by your people, mm-hmm. all right? And that's all the point I was trying to make. It's like, yeah, look, we got to look, and it's great, and it is progress. And you're, every point you made was right. At the same time, don't get lost in the sauce of that fact. I, I can see that. Yeah. No, no. That's, don't get lost in that fact. That's I, true. I, I, I agree with that. Yeah. Don't that's get lost. That's true. Yeah. But I feel like it's, it's possible to live. Because it's not for, at the end of the day, like, it's not ours. It mm. wasn't ours. No, no, it's not. It wasn't. It's not. But, but a white it, man made Black but Panther, it, right? But, but, if, he, but if but he's going to write it and okay. use things that we've invented, if we influence, his main influence is from us, we're going to take good. that as a victory. No, Shit. and that, that is Fuck a victory. That. And exactly. that, opened, that opens doors. Exactly. And that, so like I think what the problem is, people may take points that like what that man made on uh-huh. Instagram, they might take it too emotionally. He's actually just speaking Because it'll run on facts. The, exactly. It's all facts. Well, all of it. Well, I don't know. Like it, he he made like the, a few statements. Like to me, it would have been the way you expressed it was more accurate than the way he did. In okay. my opinion, Cause, okay, because that's all that's all for interpretation. Yeah, because you may yeah. have clinked onto a couple of words he said that rubbed you the wrong way. Well, wow. it, it, it was just assumptions he made. Mm-hmm. He made a few. He he made it was like oh just think about it. These people don't have your mm-hmm. best interests. Right? These but, people hate mm-hmm. you. I'm like, but that that's it was like hold on. Like I'm 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 assuming. Well, he was definitely making a very general statement, but at the same time, from my informed perspective, I knew what he was saying. He was yeah. really tr- he might have his own personal reasons why he's upset. Obviously, yeah. But what I'm course. trying to say is the statement he was trying to make was think about it, mm-hmm. and that's all it really was. Think about everything that's going on, what goes into this project, uh-huh. where it came from, who made the vision, all that. Like right. He wants you to actually look at the whole picture and not have a simple cookie-cutter answer like all the ignorant people on the internet mm-hmm. who have a simple answer for everything. But 
That was a good little debate, though. It, it was, was, though. Yeah, that was a good debate. That. That's and a, that that's made it. our point. Spread knowledge is black hair. So yeah. Right. Right. And, and don't belittle no one, man. See, we all over yeah. here talking in black right. excellence. Right. Right. So <laughs> that is. But who kid is like, yeah. I think he pulled out a pistol. He wants us to finish. Uh, yeah, all right. Yeah. Uh, this, is, this, <laughs> this is your baddie? No. <laughs> um, so this is the TBHG Project. It's your boy, Swiss Army nigga. It's your boy. <laughs> <laughs> nah, but yeah, real talk, man. Spread knowledge. This Black Hair Sea Month. And once again, want to wish y'all. Black History Month again. <laughs> what? Uh, wish y'all Black History <laughs> Month. I, I, it's Black History Month. I want to wish y'all. First black, of all, black, 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 I'm going I'm to I'm wrap it up and say, don't be CB4. Don't mm. say I'm black and you're black and I'm black, y'all. Pay attention to the shit that you sign in when your boss tells you to sign it. Mm. Look at, read a little bit of what you're looking into before yeah. you sign a user agreement. The Patriot, Act, the Patriot Act is real and they know where you at before you tell them where you moved. Oh. So first of all, stay informed, brothers. <laughs> Holy shit, that was a lot. Yeah. But anyway, this is Flockazulu Zulu. AK there's a sir. CIA agent watching us through this camera. Right Where there, now. this is this is Flakazula, aka Sir Black Sound and Third, aka No More, aka Stop the Violence. <laughs> and it's your boy Dramatic, aka Wavy McGrady, aka Wave Chappelle, aka Skip Fearless, aka Black Galifianakis, aka Stop the AKAs. Woo! <laughs> That's my AKA. Woo! All right. All right. <laughs> yeah, and I wanna we wanna leave this with saying everybody go out there and continue to be a Swiss. Army nigga, Swiss army nigga, Swiss army nigga, Swiss army nigga, Swiss army nigga. Yeah, yeah. You know who is one.